Hi guys, this is Juan from Blue Melon here from my capped video series. Um, today I'm going to talk about five things you can do when A-B testing your campaigns. So A-B test, as you know, is the ability to isolate creative factors of an ad or a piece of content that you have and just make a little tweak so you can start to understand uh, what is actually performing, what's your audience liking, why are they paying attention to, to, to certain elements of that particular ad. Um, it's, it's key to change just a very small thing from like your ad A or your piece of content A to B, otherwise you're going you're gonna to have a hard time making sense of what was that that made that change or what triggered that success on, on that particular piece of content. So the five R, number one, you can have on your captions questions or a statement on the on the ad copy or even inside the image. Uh, change the image, simple as that. Same text, same copy, everything, but just change the image. The other one is look at the differences between your call to action. So you could have in one download guide and then the other one is download report. Some people may be more around the, the, the guide word because it just um, resonates better with them. Another one is very simple is try an image with a company logo and an image without a company logo. Uh, that depends on the brand, the, str the strength of the brand. Um, sometimes works well, sometimes people don't like that. Try also, the fifth one would be having a quote versus a statistic. These days I think statistic people gravitate to, towards statistics very well, but if you got a powerful quote, it would be worth trying it. So if you need any help with content, A-B testing, let us know. A-B test your campaigns. It's a good way to start to learn what your audience is paying attention to. Hopefully you enjoy this one. Bye. Chicky bam bam, blue melon. <laughs>